Hi, Julianne Jones here with another video blog post for you. Today I'm talking about a very appropriate subject for me, and that is change. And a lot of people know that one of my famous training mottos is change is good. And one of the reasons that I always start out just about any training I do with that concept is because whenever you're learning something new or you're taking something that you've already done and wanting to improve upon it or change it, you're going to be faced with a bit of a challenge because for the most part, we as human beings don't really love change. And so you have to begin with that mindset of change is good in order to be able to be open to learning something different and uh, moving forward. And one of the things that I joke about at my live events is, you know, I start off every single one of those trainings with this concept, you know, that, that I'm going to challenge what you've always done before and I'm going to give you some new ideas today and, you know, everybody here on board with that and everybody says, yes, absolutely, change is good. And they believe that until I come to a part in the training where I'm challenging the way they've always done it, right? And the minute that happens, all of a sudden, change isn't so good anymore. <laughs> now, all of a sudden, change might be dangerous, scary, and just plain not the way we've always done it, so I'm not going to listen to this part. And when you find that coming up for yourself, no matter what it is you're learning um, about or, or, or whatever new you're learning about, you have to stop and, and ask yourself, is that supporting me? You know, and it's true that you might get through the learning, do it for a while, and realize that the way you were doing it before is better. And even with that scenario, change is still good because look what you've learned. You've identified the fact that the way you were doing it is working, and that's good. Most of the time, however, if you're learning something new because you're not satisfied with the way things are working, then you're going to end up um, making a change that's positive and changes better, you know, even better. Change is not just good, it's better in that case. So the point of this whole video blog is to remind you that whenever you start to learn something new, whenever you begin to embrace change, it's going to feel a little bit challenging. And your gremlin, that little voice in your head that tells you lies about yourself in the world, is going to pop up and say, you don't want to change because that doesn't feel comfortable and you're going to resist it. Embrace the motto, change is good. Go ahead and do something new, even if you're not perfect at it the first time, even if it feels kind of difficult to begin with, and move through it and watch what happens. In my case, every time I do that, I'm glad I have because I come out the other end with a better technique, better results, and uh, frankly, the, the, a more um, specific and, and rooted belief that change is good. Hope you're having a fabulous week, and I'll look forward to talking with you soon.